I'm here with Todd Baginski at the SharePoint Connections San Diego. And Todd, what's the one thing that people need to know about SharePoint 2010? Well, one thing people need to know about SharePoint 2010 is how easy it is to integrate it with a lot of the applications that people are using nowadays in the mobile areas. Uh, for example, you can create Windows Phone 7 applications. You can also make Android or iOS applications that interface with SharePoint. And those applications allow you to combine data from SharePoint, be it a SharePoint list or working with data inside a service to SharePoint. So, for example, you could pull list items back uh, from a SharePoint library that included pictures and videos and use the rating service with SharePoint to rate those. And then you could even see those ratings, you know, appear on side of the SharePoint website that you just rated. So that's one thing that you can do with Windows Phone 7 and SharePoint. Uh, some of the other things that you can do is combining data from the SharePoint website with other external resources such as Azure or SQL Azure. Uh, for example, you could pull items from a task list in SharePoint and then go gather more details about those tasks from a database in SQL Azure and do that all from a mobile phone application. So those are some things that I've seen recently that is the one thing you need to know you can do with SharePoint 20.